If somebody wants to know where I'm fishing, this is where I'm fishing. This bridge has to be packed with people right now. Or maybe they're by the tables. We see. Yep, there's a few people here. And I'm going to turn around here, park my car on the side, and go fishing. Jack. Oh, it came off! Oh, I don't believe that it came off. <laughs> oh, it had to be a. It, it no. Oh my God! Please don't let it be a. Oh. <laughs> oh, it came off right there. Damn. It. Please. I don't want it to be a. Um, oh, who fish is this? The tar The. The sea trout. Let it be a jack. It didn't feel like a jack though. I did tear it up, look. Right here. Right here too. I don't know because uh, the other fish has teeth too. Check that out. I just lost the fish right now. It came off my soft plastic. There's fish here. came off like right there I don't know what fish because I didn't get to see it that well I don't know if it was a speckled trout or if it was a jack it had to be one of, one of the two I'm just hoping it was a jack and not a speckled trout <laughs> alright here we go again I said, oh, what? Oh, he let go. Oh, he picked it up. Oh, he let it go. He picked it up. This is like another jack. The way they're running. Yeah, another one. All right, buddy. Let you go. Stop. Stop. All right, buddy. I know, I know. Oh. If you would stay still, you would go in the water. Ow. Damn it. Stop it. <laughs> Stop. Hey, you want to come home and be food? Gonna be tough. You ready? Here you go. Oh, oh, damn! You saw that? Did you see that? Did you see that? Oh, Lord! That had to be a big barracuda. Wow! Wow! Oh, my God! He 
just ate him up, boy. Oh, he just tore him up. <coughs> if I <coughs> if I would have hooked that fish up on my um on my bigger rod, you would have seen some awesome action. Oh my god. Well, if that's the same fish I caught, he's not coming back for the third time. <laughs> oh my God. Woo. Wow. Oh Lord. I hope that was recording. No, it's coming one by one. Damn it, it came off. Damn. It came off. It took off the tail. Why would you just take off the tail? You... Ah! Bastard. Fighter. Oh, duck. Hey. At least I caught something. Can't complain, huh? Come on, buddy. All right, all right. I'm gonna let you go. If I didn't have fish, I would keep them because they do taste really, really good. But I know. Listen to him. <laughs> this is a Jack Crevel. Nice little fish, but. Alright, buddy. I'm gonna toss you, okay? Alright, there he goes. Ah, thank you. That was nice. A little action. A little action off this guy, even though they, he took off the tail. He still wanted him. Oh, that's awesome. Damn. I thought I was recording all this time, and I wasn't. I cut another jack, and I gave it to the guy so he could take it. I go, do you want him? And he asked the other guy, do you want him? And he goes, yeah. He's almost as bait. swimming the opposite way that the other one was. So that's a Alright. Alright buddy, I'm gonna let you go. I asked the guy to see if he had a pair of pliers. He goes, no, I left it in my tackle box. I'm like, ah, oh, I did the same thing. All right, dude, I'm out. You want another one or no? Okay. He's using at his cut bait.
Peter just came after him right there as I was bringing him up. Boy. This is awesome. Okay, stop. Tore it up. Wait, I'm letting it go. I just gotta get the hook out of your mouth. Where the hell is it, dude? Didn't know my little thing, huh? I'm gonna keep on using it. See what happens. <coughs> so the one side is closed. But I asked um, a guy that was there working if I could uh, cut through here and then uh, go out of their business because this is a, like a landscaping business and last time I came through here they told me no absolutely not you know the insurance I'm like I'm just cutting through and just going out it's not like I'm gonna stay here fishing this side this is fresh water I want to fish for fresh water and right now he told me yeah of course go ahead have fun have a great day I hope you catch something I'm like thank you so now I'm, I'm going through um, this business and then I'm gonna go ahead and keep on fishing for a little bit it's good because there's a spot here that I mean I would have to walk a long distance through that side there's a car coming right now it's heading my way Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> He's like, hey, whoa, whoa, stop. And then he saw me. He goes, oh, okay. All right, cool. I guess they called him on the radio and said, listen, there's somebody going to go fishing. Let him through. Oh, look, they got them. Hi. Hello. <laughs> so be careful, let me get one video. Hold on. Hi. Hi, buddy. There you are. I was all close that you can't see him. Hi. At a distance, I was good, huh? But you, now you don't want to talk to me? <laughs> all right, let me go fishing before they say, no, you need to leave. So, that guy right there told me that I had to leave. This is private property. You can't be here. I'm like, I asked inside, and they said yes. He goes, I'm going to close the gate, and if you don't leave, you're going to be trapped in here. Damn, dude, really? Like, if I wouldn't have asked, I would say, you know, I didn't ask, but I did ask. He just didn't want me fishing here. I hate when people do this. Like, I asked permission, and they said yes. I should have just left and not recorded those those birds. He 
said, I'm closing the gate right now. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to ask permission from the person that is here. The, the manager or the owner. And see what they say. He's like, you need to leave. I'm closing the gate. There is no gate right here. Look, you see? Damn, dude, really? Wow. You could tell that there, there hasn't been people fishing there because the grass is overgrown. Fishing. I'm not going to steal down buckets or birds or plants. It's not like I'm going to be right here fishing and, and, and taking stuff. <clears throat> The one guy stopped me. He goes, no, 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 you can't be here. No, no, I'm sorry. He said, oh, okay. It's you. Like, okay, thank you. Thank you so much. But this guy. I told him I spoke to the people over here. They said, yeah, you could go fishing. That's all you're going to do. I'm like, yeah. I just want to come through and, and, and go fishing. All right, have fun. Thank you. But it's okay. I got things to do, and I'm not going to fight with an ignorant man that won't let me go fishing. That's an actual street. It's, um, I think that's 264. If that weren't a street, I would say, okay, you know, you got, you, you have the right. But that is a street, and they have it locked up. And I don't think that's right. Look, people that come fishing don't come here to freaking do something wrong, and and steal stuff, and and just do all sorts of things. We come here to, to get some food. I should go right over there to that office and ask him. If I wouldn't have stopped and recorded the birds, I wouldn't have no problems. But that same guy told me, yeah, yeah, I, I, I know. I know, I got you. And right here, I asked two guys, and they said, yeah, no, we don't have a problem with you going there. Okay, but apparently they do, because they're kicking me out. Oh, well, at least I caught some fish. I might just go home, put the kayak on, and go try it out, because it's warming up already. Here's the spot that I was saying. Look how they have it locked up. No trespassing, $500 fine. Uh, for, uh, Florida Farms. This is a, a street. This is a street. This is not like... It's 264, I think it is, or 261. This is a spot you could come fishing to, and they won't allow you because of uh, this right here. You know, last time I was fishing here, I came in my little car, and I was fishing out here. The gate was open, and I'm like, all right, I'm going to go fishing over there. Uh, I caught a few fishes, and I was already on my way back from fishing. When I came over here and that was closed up, I'm like, oh my God, you got to be kidding me. Why would they close a the damn street? So what I did was I went over that way. I kept on going and then I, I, I came out of there. But I was, I was pissed. Who knows, maybe I'll come here tomorrow on, on my bike, leave my car by the canal. And go fishing there. 
and not carry that much stuff. All right, so I'm gonna go home, put the kayak on my car and see if I can take it somewhere to try it out.